Hello, hello. What is up, you beautiful people? Hope you guys are having an amazing day. Um, if you're watching live, hashtag I'm here. If you're watching on replay, hashtag replay. Um, guys, we have a fun topic to discuss today. And the topic at hand is, is weightlifting and is lifting heavier going to make us look bulky? Okay, look, man, for uh, for the women listening and or watching, is weightlifting going to make you look manly? And for us fellas, is it going to make us look big and bulky? So um, the majority of this is going to go, it's going to be geared towards uh, the women that are listening and or watching. But guys, like, we we have an issue with this as well, okay? And we're going to be talking about this, okay? But I feel like there's so much research out there. And like covering this topic, but you know, I feel like it's like beating a dead horse, but I still see like, if you're a client, obviously listening and watching, um, I'll still see sometimes I'm like, why aren't you moving up and wait? What, what's going on? How, how come we're staying with the same 10, 15, 20 pounds? Right. And I think a lot of it is that, you know, based off of conversations I've had with, with some view and, and, and female clients and just, um, women in general is they're afraid of getting big and bulky. Okay. Um, you know, and like, you're not going to look like Tarzan or the incredible Hulk if you lift weight or you lift heavy. And like, guys, this goes for us as well, because so many of us men think that we have way more muscle than we actually do. Okay. Sorry to say, but we don't. It takes time. It takes time to build intentional muscle. And I think with men and with women, what happens is, you know, maybe when you started lifting or, you know, started working out at one point. Uh, so it could be two things. One is the misconceptions out there. Number two is if you started lifting and or um, exercising, but you still continued to have bad eating habits or even eat like shit. OK, what happens is your muscle gets larger. OK, but then so does your body fat. So it's like continuing to push out. OK, as opposed to if our nutrition is good, our nutrition is on point. We're going to lose the fat that's covering our our muscles um, and we'll be able to actually see that tone and that leanness. But what happens is a lot of us eat, continue to eat like shit and justify it because now we're working out and then the muscle is just pushing the fat out. Right. But in, in one, in the scenario or sorry, in an instance is some of us, you know, we have, we're genetically blessed in certain areas. Right. So like maybe your glutes grew or maybe uh, your arms grew or maybe your legs grew or your shoulders grew or whatever. And you're like, you know, this is my strong point and that is your strong point. So when you do get leaner and lose that fat that's covering it, it's going to be even more prominent and it's going to stick out even more. But that doesn't mean that lifting heavier is making you big and bulky. It's your nutrition that is making you big and bulky. In all actuality, you know, the hard truth of it is, is it's actually just making you gain weight and or gain fat. OK, that is what's making you big and bulky. It's the poor nutrition habits that you have. It's not the heavy lifting. OK, um, if you've been going to your local gym around you, OK, you're going to probably see some familiar faces. OK, so I've shared this before plenty of times on podcasts and whatnot, but I'm going to share this again. I have seen men in the gym. I've been going consistently i would say for the last my goodness 15 ish years okay maybe maybe less 13 something like that but i've seen a lot of the same faces okay at a lot uh, at a lot of um, local gyms and these men look exactly the same okay and they're trying like most men are trying to build muscle and trying to get big and bulky so if you're a woman listening and or watching, what do you think is going to happen to you if you have a fraction of the testosterone that these men that are actually trying have, okay? Like, you're not going to get big and bulky. You're not going to get, like, you're not going to look all crazy and jacked. You're actually going to look 
you have that lean tone f- physique and look that you're going for. Okay. So for my women, you guys produce a testosterone. You guys pr- produce testosterone at a fraction of what men would produce on a daily basis. Okay. Which is a major factor to gaining muscle. All right. Gaining actual muscle. And guys, in order to get like big, like really, really big and bulky, it takes years, okay, years of actually trying, being on point with your nutrition, being on point with your training, having just enough cardio to where it's not too much, but your your heart health is good. But like, guys, it takes a long time, okay? And it's not easy. In fact, that's harder than actually losing fat and losing weight, okay? Um, and like for for the women... Met my fellas, stick around because I got something for you too. But for my women, like, wait, you know, there's so many benefits of you continuing to lift heavier. For men and women, okay, this will help build more tone and more muscle, okay, which will help you burn more fat at a resting state, okay? So that's number one, okay? Um, number two, it can actually reduce the risk of heart disease, okay? Um, because... The stronger we are, the healthier we are. There's studies like the American Heart Association. Um, but guys, like it's actually a, it's actually an approved form. Weightlifting is actually an approved form of exercise with those um, at risk for heart disease. Okay, and most importantly for men and women, guys, like this is a great way to increase your bone density and de- and decrease the risk of um, osteoporosis. Okay, and th- and guys, like. These are just a few of the great benefits of lifting heavy, lifting safely, and lifting often, okay? So I want you to understand that lifting heavier and getting out of your comfort zone is going to change your physique drastically, all right? If you're a client here listening and watching, you have the nutrition plan set in place already for you to make sure that you succeed. That's going to reveal the hard work that you are working towards, okay? But now we actually have to have that base and that model so that we can see that physique, okay? So you build your body in the gym and in your workouts, okay? And then you reveal it through your nutrition, all right? Don't be afraid of lifting heavy. Lift heavy, lift safely, lift often, and I promise you, you're going to see your physique change night and day, okay, in just a few months from where you're at to where you want to get to, all right? Hope you guys all have an amazing rest of your day. Let me know what questions you have in the comments if you're watching live or on re- or if, yeah, if you're watching live or on replay and uh make sure to go lift heavy and I want you guys to all get uncomfortable this week and get out of your comfort zone and push some heavier weight this week, all right? Hope you have an amazing rest of your day and we'll talk soon.